Hello everybody, my name is Markiplier and welcome to Bad Dream Butcher. Now this is the first part in a six part series of point and click horror games. Uh, not that I know much about it, but it's supposed to be very, very good. And I'm interested because of the simplistic style that it was presented, because looking at the screenshots it doesn't seem like there was a lot going on. But, 73, I could read that from where I was, whoa. I didn't mean to do that. Why did that break? Was there a reason for that breaking? Okay, so it's a point-and-click style adventure game, which, like a lot of the horror games that I play- Oh, 73! I know that number! I just read that number! I'm smart and can remember numbers! Uh, I can't talk right, but I can remember. Oh. Alrighty then. There's a lot of negative space not being taken advantage of in this game. I don't know if that's supposed to mean something or what. Okay, so- Oh. Ow! Oh, I got sharp glass! Oh, I guess I need to put my face in the bottom, but I seem to be a little more bloody than I was before. That's weird. It's really weird. I guess I don't need any more glass. I can go this way, though. Hi! Hi how are you, cat pig? Did you just bite me? You little bastard! Take this hammer to your face, that's what I'll do. Why did you bite me? Why did I put my hand towards a cat pig? Obviously it was not friendly. Okay. Cool. Oh, I'm missing a finger? What the hell? It bit off my finger! Okay, so I got the key to 33. That's weird. 99. Great! 99 red luft balloons! So... Okay. Let's not stick my fingers in any unusual places, which is my normal habit. Oh, are those spiders? Oh, those are maggots. Great, I got one. Congratulations, me. I got a maggot. I'm so happy that I could not have maggots. <laughs> okay. So that's not 15, that's- Something weird's going on here. Something very strange is happening. Yeah, this is unusual, like it's catching me off guard because I don't know what I'm doing and I don't know why I need to do the things that I need to do. Is that covered up by human skin? Or skin of any sort would be disturbing. Also, I guess I'm done here. Hi, buddy. Can I have my finger back, you bastard? Can I go? Okay, so I got a key to 33, but not a key to 73. Why do I need a sharp glass magnet and a hammer? Seems like illogical things. Oh, hey, here we go. Hi, birdie. Are you gonna bite my finger off? Okay. I got a twig. I'm just a kleptomaniac picking up everything and anything that I. Excuse me, Birdie. I was talking. I don't even know if that was you, but, uh, don't interrupt. Alright, so I got a twig. Okay, that was definitely you. You can shut up now. I can't even, like, click on the things in my inventory to try to interact with anything in the environment. I guess that's for the best, because that means I won't be wasting my time. Okay, so I can't go in there. I did get a twig, though. So that's an accomplishment. I did that. Alright, so that... Can I... This is weird. This is weird. Hey, can I hammer that? Oh, oh, there's more! Oh, oh! Oh, hi! Eyeball! Ha! Oh, that was a thing. I just- oh. Hey! What? How is that a thing? Oh, did he bash it open trying to get out? After I step- oh. Is that a shadow of a thing up there? Hi! Oh, hi! Uh, so many things and questions that I have, but, uh, I don't want to stay around here too long. God damn. Ooh, there we go. 51, good. But what about the door to 15? Where is that? I don't know. So, is that my reflection or is that someone standing in the window there? Okay. Alrighty then. That's a thing. Hi. <laughs> Is that you, Krillin? You don't look so good. Oh, wow. I'll just be on my way then. <laughs> oh, okay. Alrighty then. 
So now I gotta make my way back to door, uh... Hi? What was that? Well, he cut off my finger, why should I be upset? What the hell was that about? Oh. Oh. Oh, I thought that was an end. I thought I died. I'm not doing so good, am I? Jesus. Oh, the twig did that. If I'd have done that with my finger, I would have lost another one because I've lost two so far. And now I'm giving the super finger a la Dane Cook. Huh, huh, huh. Does Dane Cook even do anything anymore? I don't know. Who knows? Who knows these things? Okay. So is there anything else I can do? Okay, I got the mouse trap. So, oh, oh, there was a mouse. There was a mouse hole. There was a mouse hole back here. No, in the, uh, ooh. I saw that! I saw that! I saw that! <laughs> ha 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 ha! Oh no! Oh, I got you! Oh no, I still lost one! I should stop sticking my hand near things! Gotcha! Take that, dead rat! I sure got you! I showed you a thing, or two. Let me get out of here before I lose any more. Okay, so what do I do with a dead rat? Do I feed it to the pig? Oh, uh, let me just fish it out with my one remaining finger. Oh, speaking of fishing out, I got a hook. So, what am I gonna do with a hook? Am I supposed to, am I supposed to know what I'm supposed to do with this? I, oh. Oh, that's right. <laughs> no! Damn it. Did I lose my last one? I've got no fingers left on that hand. Oh. Hope. Can I have my fingers back? Bam. Cool. Key. Key to what exactly? How do I have any anything left on my hand? I don't know. And what was the point of that? Why did I need to lose a finger to do that? Damn it. Okay, good. I guess we're moving forward now. Okay, key there. I still- Oh, he took my thumb! Oh, I still have just my little, little ring finger left. That's good. I'm glad. This is a happy time. Oh, boy. I don't know if there's, like, any way to actually not lose any of your digits. Okay. Either that or I'm just very bad at this game. Ah, here we go. Okay. I got a fishing rod! Okay, so now I assembled that with the hook and the rope, or the wire. Okay, so now that I have a fishing rod, I can do some fishing? I guess? So where do I do fishing? I got a maggot too! Oh. What was that? <laughs> Hi. Hi, clown! You look good! Okay, so now that I got a fishing rod... Ooh, ooh, here! Yeah! Oh, I did something else. Okay, I got a wet rag. Great, great for me! Why? Why do I have a wet rag? Why did I need a wet rag? Why was a wet rag the most important thing in my life? Hi. Oh, uh, I'm not- I'm just- thank you, bye, I'm gone. Thank you. I did not need any of that. I don't need any of your wares from this lovely store that you have. So I got a wet rag. So what about that? Oh, hey, okay! Alright! Okay! Okay! Alright! Okay! Oh! Oh cool, I got a pot! I can make din din! Bang bang! Dinner everybody! Escape the nightmare with some lunch! Or dinner, cause I just said that. Okay, so I got a full pot. Now... I... Will do things with this. Ah, oh, there was a stove. I know, I know. There was a stove. Why do I need to? Yay! I did it! Good! Let me get some maggot stew going up in this baby! Yeah! I'm gonna feed the hungry and the poor! Meaning me! Oh, hey, okay, that's a thing. Alright. Jeez, why is this game so creepy? Like, this is a really, really interesting and creepy game. Okay, so I gotta find a place. Is there, like, somewhere that I have not been? Oh! Oh, I got a dead fish!
fish. I fished it out of a toilet. That's delightful. I'm gonna whip that baby up and into a stew. Did I, did I fish the dead fish out of that pipe that led from that toilet to here? And also, how did I do that? Okay, whatever. I'm gonna make me some dead fish stew and not, oh, mm. What? Oh! Oh no! I made finger and dead fish stew! I'm the butcher of me! I'm my own butcher! That's so weird! And cool? Either way, this is the first part in a six part series, like I said. I mean, if you guys want to see it, I'm definitely gonna play it, but frankly, I kind of want to play it myself. This is really, really interesting game. I mean, for being a point and click, and not saying there's anything wrong with a point and click, but it's a genre as old as like the earliest of games. But I mean, this was really, really well done. It was well executed. There were so many little surprises hidden throughout the game, and I thought I was doing something horribly wrong by getting my fingers all chopped off. But maybe it's like, I don't think you needed to get your fingers chopped off at anyone. You could have escaped it. I just didn't know how. But that being said, it ended up with a tasty stew. Mwah, mwah, mwah. So thank you everybody so much for watching. Check out the other scary games that I played in the playlist down in the description below. Or in the annotation over there. There's like 200 of them. Lots of scary games from years past. So thanks again everybody for watching. And as always, I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye! blow skills. You know that red text when it says artifact is found makes me think that I might die soon. Why do I die soon? No, thank you! Oh, it's so gross! Why am I still looking at it? This game doesn't rely on a string quartet on my back. It just has a guy playing a sousaphone in my ear. Pop that sousaphone!